You may be noticing a smell of smoke in Rochester this morning. There is a definite haze in the air from a controlled burn. Keelop Fitzgerald went to check on that fire this morning. He joins us live with more in a story a lot of people are asking questions about. Good morning, Keelop. Good morning, Jess and Byron. I found out where that smell is coming from, and if you're in the west side of Rochester, chances are you're catching a whiff of it as well. It is a controlled burn taking place here at Hathaway Tree Service. Joining me now to put that into context is the owner of Hathaway Tree Service, Richard Cordy. Now, Richard, this burn, controlled burn, I must emphasize controlled, has been going on for about a day now. You want to just kind of tell us what we're looking at here? Well, we're looking at a controlled burn with equipment uh, and wind diverters and stuff like that. Um, what has happened here in the city of Rochester, we used to produce a lot of biofuel. 480 semi-loads used to go to the Twin Cities to support a plant up there at, at St. Paul. We no longer have that contract and lost that in May, so our supply of wood is totally built up. It's not feasible and economical to grind all this, so what we've done is elected on a south wind with a permit to burn and control this fire and it'll take four to five days so I apologize for the smoke uh, and if you get a little smell out of it but we're going to try to really control it. Um, I, I really appreciate and thank you. Mm -hmm. All right and Richard there are a lot of trees here and a lot of wood. Uh, you want to just kind of tell us where all this came from? Are these Christmas trees? Are these uh, brush that's been cleared from other areas? Uh, we've had an overload of a lot of trees come into the site since May. We've got an EAB, which is the ash bore, which has created just a tremendous amount of trees coming in here. Uh, there's probably a thousand ashes alone are, are in this site. We service the city of Rochester and all the general public around here to, uh, to come into this site. Um, and uh, it's just a lot, a lot of trees. All right, thank you very much, Richard. This has been Keelot Fitzgerald reporting live near Rochester, KTDC News.